The real concern over measles and tonight a public health emergency has now been declared in Washington state and authorities there say there is a common thread. They also say if someone infected visits a store or a restaurant, a school, that that virus then hangs in the air for up to two hours. ABC's chief national correspondent Matt Gutman is in Vancouver, Washington for us. That measles outbreak growing by the hour. My biggest concern is the numbers increase that we lose a child to this disease and something that is completely, utterly preventable. Tonight, at least 30 of the 35 patients sickened with the measles in Clark County, Washington, were never vaccinated. There are an additional 11 suspected cases. Experts here warn the public might have been exposed at a recent Portland Trailblazers game at Portland's airport, at area schools, a local Costco, and Ikea. Washington State has been called a hot spot because of its anti-vaccine movement. It has one of the lowest vaccination rates in the country, but it's not just in the Northwest. New York State has registered 184 measles cases in just the past four months. The highly contagious virus can live on surfaces or in the air for up to two hours. Callie Cato's two-year-old daughter is immunocompromised after a recent liver transplant. How does this outbreak affect you? I'm worried. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm very worried. Measles had all but disappeared in the U.S. after widespread use of the vaccine, but in recent years, it's made a comeback. The number of measles infections has tripled just since last year, David, and now the World Health Organization considers reluctance to vaccinate one of its top 10 global threats for 2019. David. ABC's Matt Gutman with us tonight. Matt, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.